The Oxford language has just rolled out an exciting update to the Oxford English Dictionary featuring a vibrant array of unique Guyanese English words that celebrate the rich culture of the country. So what are these words? One standout addition is Belna, which has been around since 1872. This delightful term refers to a rolling pin used in baking roti, a staple in many Caribbean kitchens, and it is borrowed from Hindi. Then there's feg, dating back to 1875, which describes a segment of citrus fruit or a clove of garlic perfect for those zesty Caribbean dishes. Afro-Guyanese culture shines through with kwekwe, a word from 1954 that captures the spirit of pre-wedding celebrations filled with feasting and dancing. It likely has roots in a West African language echoing traditions that have traveled through generations. Feeling lovesick? You might want to use taipi from 1970, a charming term for intense infatuation. Though its origins remain a bit mysterious, it definitely captures the flutter of young love. Let's not forget the playful side of Guyanese life. Caddy Old Punch, 1991, refers to homemade kites crafted from school book pages while kids engage in Ketcha, 1979, a lively game reminiscing of tag. And then when it comes to manners, children are taught not to be hard ears or to disrespect by using someone's first name without proper acknowledgement. This is known as speaking full mouth from 1960. For those early risers, four day morning 1916 refers to the magical hours before dawn, often filled with the aroma of butterflap 1978 and Solara 1985. Sweetbreads that make mornings a little brighter. And in the bustling streets of Guyana, a towel from 2011 is a slang for a $1,000 bill, while Prags from 1990 denotes handouts of gifts showcasing the generous spirit of the community. These additions to the Oxford English Dictionary not only enrich the dictionary, but also celebrates the vibrant tapestry of Guyanese life. Go check them out.